Hello everyone, how's it going? Uh, today, I wanted to talk a little bit about the progress on my school. School community, where I'll be teaching, which is called Swarm. Where I'll be teaching agent building on Copilot. So, I am going to try, because everyone seemed to enjoy that aspect of, of hyper-focus. Hyper focus, meaning giving you only what you need in order to learn the basics of that topic, all right? Because you're given so much information, there's no way you can learn it all. So if we condense it down to only the most important information, you're going to have a better chance of remembering it. So here's an example. So when I tell you that, uh, so over on the uh, left-hand side, of the home page for Copilot Studio, you only have five buttons. Home page, right? Uh, create, agents, flows, and tools, right? Simple, but that means when I tell you what these do, you're gonna have to remember and understand what they are. Like, so this is for to create an agent, right? But it's not a flow, and you're gonna have to know the difference between agent and flow. So here is where we create an agent that's autonomous, right? This is what we'll be using most of the time. Here is where we can view our agents. And here are flows, right? These are deterministic. You're going to have to know what that means. That's what deterministic means. The outcome's predictable and always the same. So it's always going to go in order. This step, that step, this step. Where this, this guy, right, he's going to be able to use, we'll say these are tools, whatever tool he wants. And I'll give you another example. So I'll, I will transition to a, another video that talks about creating agents conversationally. Now, you're going to have to know what that means. I don't think anyone else has this, uh, and I don't like it, but you're still going to have to know what it means. And if it comes up in conversation, because it's a fundamental part of Copilot, you're going to have to explain why you don't like it or why you use it. I can easily explain why I don't like it. Right. You're going to have to do that. So, again, uh, we're getting there. We're almost ready for probably another three weeks away from starting out. Uh, but it does, it's going to be hyper-focused, right? And there are a lot of nuances. Like, every platform has a lot of nuances. But certainly, Microsoft has a lot of nuances. And for the hyper-focused path, you're going to have to pay attention. All right? So, when I say something, you're going to have to know this and take notes and be able to talk about it educably. All right, I will show a, a video here coming up about creating agents conversationally, again, which I do not like, but you will still need to know what that means, mostly for technical interviews. All right, so here we are at the homepage. Here, we said earlier, is where we can create our agent conversationally. Now, so what does that mean? It means we can walk through the entire creation process just by having a conversation with Copilot. Let's click on Help Desk, and it says Provide Employees with Help on Troubleshooting Issues. All right, let's click our Airplane button. And now, it's going to ask us a whole bunch of questions that it needs to know to create an outline to create the basics for our agent. On the right-hand side, you can see the entire agent creation process as being documented for us. Now, I'm not a fan of this. I don't like this approach. So I'm gonna hit skip to configure. And now we can create the agent knowing exactly what fields we need to fill in. So let's go ahead and talk about each of these fields. 